two types of law, right? The law that you're researching is on par with the other type of law that you're more familiar with, right? A statute is a law that is passed by the legislative branch and signed by the executive. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, good. Right, but the health care bill. The bill is being debated by the legislative branch and it will hopefully be signed by the president. Now you're looking at a different kind of law. You're looking at judicial opinions or case law. Law that is created by the courts by its interpretation of the Constitution or laws that were already passed by the legislative branch. So each of you have a case. Your case has a life. It has a place, a point of origination. That's what the first part of the assignment is, to come up with that place of origination. What is the dispute in where your case came out of? So each of you, there's a dispute with the police, there's a search, there's someone who's claimed their rights have been violated, there's an event in which someone has been sued for. That's the first part. Where did this originate? The second part is in the opinion itself, and that is the rationale. What's the rationale that suspects are to be given warning about their right against self-incrimination or their right to an attorney? What's the rationale for allowing women to have reproductive freedom? What is the point of why the government is not allowed to segregate according to race? In the opinion is the rationale, the logic of the case opinion. That's the second part. The third part may come from newspapers or law review articles. What's the effect of these things on society? Some of those you just might look around at society and just create from what you think that the effects on society would be from the opinion that you have. Okay? So again, each of these had oral argument in Washington, had judges vote on them, and now they've created a foundation of our legal system.